who they were off that live one. But yeah, they was two or three on, on each of the farms. And I tell you, that young one who's about 18 chatted me up. What, the German? Yes. I was walking home. I'd been to the pictures. as was a summer night. And uh, I didn't want to go anywhere. And I didn't want the chips. I thought to myself, I'm going home. Lovely evening that was. That was about half past eight. And so I thought, I'll walk home. Play you village people about but thank god that night that evening there wasn't nobody i thought anyone come they'll tell my father that won't go down very well i was nearly shitting myself because because they were going past here and there on their bikes you see because they were they were harmless i suppose young men what germans germans you see so they all nearly all had bikes who who lived on the farms? Right. Where they got the bikes, I don't know. And he come along. He said, "Good evening." Perfect English. He ain't no more. He wasn't no more than eighteen. How old were you? Uh, 16, 15, 16. 16. So he said, "Good evening," and I spoke to him. And so he uh, he was on this on the road. Just saying, I was on the path. So then he knew I answered him. He 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 got off the bike and he said, I've been to Yarmouth. I said, oh, that's nice for you. And he was chattering away. We were nearly to the swan. Right, I know what you mean. To her to the village people, are you all right, Joyce? Yes, thank you. Nearly died. I thought, oh, God, that'll be all over the village. <laughs> um... I'll tell my dad, but of course he was in the army, so he wouldn't know. But mum, I thought that mum will think, what the hell? So when we got to the, I, which I turned and walked through the village, where yeah. he went right up past the church, because yeah. that's where the farm was. Yeah. So he say, you, before we got there, he say, you go this way? I said, no. I go around there, he say, oh, but you come this way? I said, no, thank you. <laughs> I didn't, I went rude. So he got on his bike and off he went. Bloody good enough, man. Yeah, I thought, so if you are bloody right, what do you think you've got? Do you think I come off a Christmas tree? Because <laughs> there's all woods up there and, uh, and church. I mean, there's only one house. Yeah. I mean, McDonald's weren't there then. No. <laughs> I thought, you are right. And then we had Italians. Right. They worked on that. What, from the war? Or just... That, the war time? Yeah. The Italian... The Italian prisoners of war camp was one up one part of Ella, where the sail and that is all up there. The, the Ella Marker. The Marker. Yeah. They had a German one and an Italian one, and they had one in Bungie. Right. The space where the co-op now is. Ah. Was it German prisoner of war camp? No, that was Italian. Oh, that Italian. was in, in Bungie. Oh, wow. But now, I don't know where, because a Bungie girl married one of the prisoners. Right. A Ginter, his name was. Oh. Audrey Huron. He didn't look no more than 20. Blonde, of course. And uh, he, they walked about freely. They had uh, to be in at a certain time. They went out at night times. Right. So they had to be in at a certain time. They had a curfew. But they could go to the pictures. They could go to the shops if anyone would serve them. We couldn't make that out. No, I'm not surprised. And, because uh, Sundays, lots of the people in Beckles I used to get on the quay because that is a lovely spot isn't it? and this was a summer's day I can't remember I was taking someone's dog someone's dog out because we didn't have a dog and um, there was three Germans prisoners sitting on the seat laughing and talking free as birds and I come along couldn't have been more than 12 or 13. I was still at school. Nice doggy, one of them went. 
Do you know what I've done? What? I said, and that doesn't like Germans. <laughs> well, they roared were laughing. Because <laughs> I think there was one, one there, what couldn't have, he couldn't have spoke English because he told him what I said. And they absolutely doubled up. Respect, they thought, cheeky little stars. No, good for you, Nan. I did, I said, and he doesn't like Germans. <laughs> Hardly any, you know, there was a shop in the town, what would serve them. Yeah. Didn't get a very good greeting, mind you, but they, they said, well, I suppose they only got to sell things once, didn't they? Yeah. But